So when it comes to traveling, I really hate paying full price. Therefore, I use credit cards and try to get sign-up bonuses that allow me to fly to various and sundry parts of the world. And every year I try to sign up for a new card or two that will help me achieve my travel goals. Well, it was recently time to start looking for another credit card to start building up a stash of American Airlines points. So you might be wondering what credit card did I actually apply for? I got the City Business Platinum Select American Airlines Advantage card from Citibank. And this card comes with a very nice 65,000 point bonus for spending just $4,000 over the first four months you have the card. You also might be wondering how I can get a business card. Well, as long as you have any kind of business where you can show income over the course of a year, a lot of banks will extend you credit. This can be anything as simple as selling something on Amazon or eBay. I write some freelance articles and get paid for them, and therefore I need internet access so I can get some expenses on the business card that way. So here is the actual city business homepage, and it shows you, as I said before, that you can earn 65,000 frequent flyer miles in the Advantage program after spending $4,000 in the first four months of account opening. There is an annual fee of $99, but fortunately that is waived for the first 12 months, so you don't have to pay it to get the bonus. If you keep the card past the year mark, you will have to pay that annual fee, but the first year it's totally free. Also, another benefit is there are no transaction fees on foreign purchases, so that is a benefit that you might want to think of as well. Before I get into some of the other benefits of the card, I just wanted to take a minute to thank you for watching and encourage you, if you've not already done so, to hit that like button and also subscribe to the channel. I would really appreciate it and it will help this information get out to more people. If we want to look at some of the additional benefits that come with this card, we'll have to scroll down on this home page and we'll see that for every dollar you spend on American Airlines, this could be for airfare or any additional purchases you make while you're on your flight, think in terms of food or beverages, you'll earn two Advantage miles for every dollar you spend with American Airlines. You'll also get a bonus point or two Advantage miles for every dollar you spend on purchases at telecommunications merchants. Think in terms of AT&T, uh, T-Mobile, Verizon, places like that. You'll also earn extra miles for cable and satellite providers, car rental merchants, and gas stations. If we look just at these bonus categories, spending with the City Business Platinum Select American Airlines business card is probably not going to add up to the points that you want unless you have a lot of business expenses every month. What the main benefit is from my perspective is the 65,000 bonus points that are available when you hit the sign up bonus. Um, so that's why I primarily signed up for the card. If you find that you fly American Airlines frequently and you have a lot of business spending, it might benefit you because once you start to spend more and more, you will get up and earn higher status with American Airlines. Here are a few more of those benefits. As I said, you'll earn one Advantage mile per dollar you spent, which is not a great bonus structure. You will, however, earn loyalty points towards Advantage status. So when you spend on the card for every dollar you spend, you get a loyalty point. And once you get up to 40,000 of those loyalty points, you'll get gold status, which entitles you to upgrades if they're available and someone above you in status is not flying on the same flight as you. We can scroll down a bit more. You'll get a free checked bag with the card on only domestic itineraries. I do want to say that a few years ago, I was flying to Aruba on an international ticket and I did not get to benefit from this. Uh, and anyway, that's just something to keep in mind. And if you keep spending and spending and spending, you will get up to $30,000 in a year. And if you do that, you will get a free companion certificate so that a friend, loved one, spouse, kid, parent, whoever can fly with you for $99 plus a few airport taxes. And that's another benefit. Um, I won't be spending anywhere near $30,000 on this card, but you might find that it fits your spending needs just fine. So these are all of the benefits of the card. 
The main benefit, however, that I want to point out is that 65,000 American Airlines Advantage miles after you spend $4,000 in purchases during the first four months for a fee free year. The next year you'll have to pay a $99 annual fee. So where can you go with this bonus? If you spend just the $4,000 that you're required to spend in the first four months, and it's all at the one point per dollar level, you'll get 69,000 points after you hit the bonus. How many tickets you can actually get will depend on where you want to go and when you want to go. If you want to go during high season to Europe, you may not even get a full round trip ticket. If you want to go to say Bismarck in February, you might be able to get three or four tickets round trip from wherever you happen to live. I will say that I have flown to Europe on multiple occasions for about 30,000 miles one way. Sometimes you can't get the return flight for 30,000 miles, but you, you can possibly get a round trip coach ticket from the United States to Europe for about 60,000 miles. There is a down season where you can get better uh, coverage or better availability for one of those cheaper flights. And sometimes you'll even have less than 60,000 miles coming out of your account. I have looked at tickets to Japan as well. And during the summer, you can get like one one-way ticket to Japan, not back, they cost a little bit more, but one one-way ticket to Japan on American Airlines for about 35 to 40,000 miles. So there are a lot of places that you can go at a relatively cheap amount. And if you go to the Caribbean, sometimes you can go there for 25 to 35,000 miles round trip. So just a little more spending and you could get, you know, a honeymoon flight taken to Mexico or somewhere in the Caribbean like Aruba or Jamaica. I think I paid 25,000 miles for a couple of tickets each. So 50,000 miles got me two round trip tickets to Montego Bay. There are plenty of places that you can redeem these points. So it is worth looking into. I do want to say that any of these tickets that you take outside of the United States, you're going to pay more than the $5.60 cent 9-11 fee. You actually have to pay airport taxes that are not included in the fare. And if you fly with partner airlines like British Airways, you can get socked with pretty high fuel surcharges. And even if you're only paying the taxes in a lot of instances, especially London Heathrow, that can be like $150 per ticket added on to the points that you have, which is better than paying six, eight hundred, a thousand dollars for a round trip ticket. So you can save quite a bit of money. So anyway, I hope you have enjoyed the video, that you've learned something about the city business, uh, American Airlines Platinum Select card, and hopefully it will help you decide whether it's something that you want to look into. If so, please, again, feel free to hit that like button and hit the subscribe button. I will appreciate it a great deal. So until next time, have a great day.